This liquor came outside a one way conversation. Reacting to something that nobody else could see. While I sit at the table and I relive our whole situation. Until the valet that wants to go home comes in and gives me my keys. And tonight every single star will shine. The power lines all sizzle and buzz. And now that it's too I see it all for what it was. There's nothing sad in the street light shining on a stretch of empty sidewalk. Or maybe the fog that I've lived in has lifted for the first time in weeks. Every day has been a step forward, perfecting the art of my small talk. So I never have to say anything I might really need. And I remember all the final words you told me, how I was too green. Now that it's too late to live, I can see how that is true. Now when I am in your city, I'll come across the company you've been keeping. They all hit it off so well with some infinite schools from my past. And it's so hard to imagine what you could have possibly told them. Some wonder how I'm doing, but most don't even ask. But now every single door is held open. I've even signed a few autographs. And now that it's too late, we can both look back and laugh. There's always more to say, so I'm just sticking to the end. When you move back to Texas, and I find a girl that wants to change your name. When we both start to forget all the problems that were never worth having. Everybody goes on living, watching, nothing really change. Well, there will always be a part of you that's with me. And you sure as hell had better feel the same. Cause now that it's too
incredible. I don't mean me, I mean you. <laughs> that would have been kind of weird. Every song I finished, that was amazing. I hope you guys don't mind, but I have a lot of songs you've never heard before planned. Um, (laughs) 
And for the few people out there that were very bummed about that bit of news, I promise I'll be scattering some <laughs> normal DAW songs in here. But, uh, yeah. The song's about a life of a songwriter. Was that a happy father's day ever? Yeah. I will take it. I have some Father's Day songs coming up <laughs> for all the dads. How, is this a Father's Day present for anybody? No. All right. All right, then. then I'll make sure to get to the dad songs. Yeah, this song's about the life of the songwriter. It's called The Game. Harmony 
is only just a shadow of the way you felt the first hundred times around, which left it to the critics and the experts to tell the world how Millie really felt to somehow say she lost the competition she was only ever happy with herself. Well, some might look for meaning in the ashes. She just misses standing in the flame. The losers only think about the winners. The winners only think about the game. All the losers only think about the winners. Thank you. <laughs> this song's called Surprise, but has an exclamation point at the end of it. Once the gatekeepers decided we would fade into the crowd, it took what makes you charming and you turned it up to the loud. Now how many songs is the bad I could get before you steal away the mic? How many cases do you have to jump out of before no one else surprised? I remember us both a day That no one's dreams come true To be the night by how you saw them Or the goalpost just gets moved That's when you change your expectations Started rolling your third eye But you still don't know the ending You can't spoil the surprise Now the nature of your birthday party has changed a lot for me. What was once a celebration feels like a shameless victory. I guess we all confuse our happiness with what it takes to just survive. But the moment that the switch gets flipped is always a surprise. There's a little bit of poetry in what you're doing to your face, removing all the evidence of our shared time and space. But your eyes close when you smile now, cause you're squeezing it too tight. If this is how you double down, you're in for a surprise. There's a nightclub deep in Hollywood for each night of the week. Watching all my fake friends congregate when no one wants to be. But you have to murder through it if you want to make it out alive. And the ones that find the other side are in for a surprise. I'm not letting myself off easy here. I've been going through it too. I might have even the things more gracefully, but what good did that do? You found a way to rage against the dying of the light. I thought I planned for all contingencies. 
I thought I knew who I was meant to be All the roads laid out in front of me But it's still a big surprise So we're going to break this into two sets, give you guys all the bathroom opportunities that are possible for a night like this, when there's no opener, you know? Otherwise, there's no break. And I don't want you getting up in the middle of the song. Because then I start spinning out, I start to get words. <laughs> we have before. <laughs> Time and place. 
Maybe that would crack the case.
going to sound pretty fancy, but you may or may not know, but Brandy Carlisle has invited this like small group of people around Joni Mitchell at her house in Bel Air, and we're all singing Joni songs together, and um, singing our own songs sometimes. It's pretty surreal. Joni's the greatest it ever was, and it's, it's, it's incredible to be in her presence. But sometimes after we're done singing a bunch of Joni stuff, Brandy, um, it's like, all right, everybody sing one, you know? And Brandy blows our minds with her, with everything about her, and then Lucio will sing a song, or Marcus Mumford will sing a song, and um, they wanted, Brandy asked me to sing a song next this one particular night. And I thought, well, you know, everyone's like, really just, it's been very emotional, it's been very, um, sad in some cases, and I said, I'll sing house parties, because that, that'll just, that'll help lighten the mood. And I had Joni going. Um, she, like the first verse in chorus, everyone was laughing, and Joni was like in her chair, kind of vibing out and smiling. The second chorus um, mentions her, um, so I think you got to kick out of that. Um, and then it was funny, like everything was going great. And then um, at the end of the song where it says, uh, I don't care about, Forget the exact word, but uh, all go again, a starry night or the son of man. Like Joni Mitchell, the painter, just was like, mm. like, <laughs> <laughs> and she and like when I finished the song, everyone was like, yeah, it's amazing, and she was like, don't knock a starry night. <laughs> you need to take that out of your song. And I was like, it's satirical. I'm not saying this is how I feel. I'm just saying this is how the guy in the song feels. And she's like, don't knock a starry night. She's really very cool. So if you hear a future version of that song. Like, that doesn't have that line, it's because I listen to the boss. Um, I, uh, I, I, this is like the first time I've had some time to myself for a minute. Um, so I was like writing songs today. Um, I might try to sing them for you. That's okay, they're brand new, so. I feel like there's no cool environment to have a song that's... I mean, how often do you hear a song from this many people that's like four hours old or whatever? <laughs> I had some of it in the past, but... I kind of figured it all out today. It's called California Fires. Yeah. It's a real uplifting one. <laughs> Catch the setting sun. We saw the smoke from Pasadena in a few more ways than one. I thought I wished upon a star, but it was just some tower in the hills. I didn't know I strayed so far Now I probably never will First months of my twenties, I finally hit the road, making sure it didn't vary from the stories that I've been sold. I released so many memories. I set my child to the side. 
But when my hometown was just mentioned, it lit a fire that I denied. I used to only feel the dark. Now it's the biggest, brightest lights that really kill. I didn't know I strayed so far. Now I probably never will. Now it's burning its way towards Oxnard, north by northwest. The containment isn't changing, so I keep the page refreshed. The major roads are closing, and I heard the school burn down. With its memories of those teenage ghosts we left behind when we left town. Families loading up their cars with the few essentials needed to rebuild. I didn't know we strayed so far. Thank you. It's so fun doing shows like these where I can have a moment like that, because otherwise you won't be hearing that song maybe ever or at least for a long time. It's also fun being in a band because uh, when you write chords like this, you just know all the really good musicians in the band are going to do some freaky shit. song right now, and you guys are all going to go to the back. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> but I know there's a silent auction. I signed a guitar. If nobody bids, it'll be very embarrassing. <laughs> so even just for my sake. As I stand over my breakfast and stare out in the street, I find that sorrow I've been chasing way too often. That the man that sits in front of you is not the sum of all his dreams, but I'm hoping they've got something in common. I'm hoping they got something common. The way that love attacks and then surrenders. The things I mean the most when I say her name. And if he ever speaks to me casually, I hope he does so carefully Cause when you love somebody 
everything's to blame. And I don't want to ever feel ashamed. But all my best kept secrets from the ones I didn't know I had. So I couldn't even tell her if I wanted That the way that she remembers me Is not the way I really am But I'm hoping they've got something in common I'm hoping they've got something in common I'm hoping they got some, hoping they got something in common. So I feel like a man behind a camera who waits patiently for something he won't see. I need to stop giving suggestions and just illuminate the questions. That seems much more accurate to me to keep the frame as wide as it can be. Cause all the love and friends and happiness that ever came my way reveal themselves the moments I stop watching Cause it's not faith that comes from miracles The miracles that come from faith I'm sure that they got something in common so I know that they got something in common I know that they got something She'll just have to learn how she is going to use it. Maybe it's some cold, dark truth that makes her cry. Maybe it's some ancient past life memory to call. Maybe it's a chemical that got into the light. Or maybe it's for no good reason at all. Maybe it's for no reason at 
His wife asks how are things at work today. As Bill walks through the door, he put his coat on a chair, keys on the table, and eyes down on the floor. And he tightened his jaws, and he thought how the cause and effects were clear. Figuring out how to say what's wrong. I said I knew it, I believe it. That's all I really know. But I wish I could tell what exactly compels me to turn my steps and go. Because there's so much love that you've given me. And so much love that I owe. It's with myself that I can see to get along. Maybe he just fell hungry and a pain. Maybe he won't rest until he sees it fall. Maybe it's the mood that he's in just for the day. Yeah, maybe it's for no good reason at all. Maybe it's for no good reason at all. An actor was found dead today. In his Culver City home, and with no evidence of foul play, it seemed he'd acted on his own. The position of his body looked like he was reaching for the phone. Makes you wonder who he was gonna call. Maybe all his tears were settling their debts. Maybe all the pressure finally. Throw him to the wall. Maybe there were secrets that he needed to protect. Or maybe it's for no good reason at all. Maybe it's for no good reason. No good reason. No good reason at all. I'm playing another new one, a couple in a row actually, then I'm pretty sure you guys have heard. <laughs> Unless you were like spying on me, or you were at this weird acoustic winery thing I did two days ago. It was cool, it was cool. When I say weird, I mean fucking awesome. <laughs> but uh, that was the first time I sang it. It kind of goes with uh, California Fire a little bit. It's called Front Row C. As slowly as a yogi stretches at an unsafe part, I tiptoe toward the gravity. Of the predicament we live. I know it, I know it. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna start over. As slowly as a yogi stretches at an unsafe part, I tiptoe toward the gravity of the predicament we live. I prefer leaving the alone, sitting firmly in the dark. Instead of facing one more tired vision of the end, but if that's the ball game, if the experiment complete, and we all stand around to watch it all come down, at least we got a front row seat. I got good at changing subjects nearly everywhere I went Until all my conversations all got too good to be true This world can wax poetic 
about airborne toxic events while I take the time that's left me and I give it all to you cause if that's the bargain if the experiments complete and we are still around to watch it all come down at least we got a front row seat. If it's true that it's a curse to live in interesting times, then why do I get butterflies as I peek over the land? I'll bring some popcorn, babe. You get the wine. Just don't pay for the whole seat if all you needed was the edge. Cause if that's the bargain, if the experiment's complete, then we all stand alone to watch it all come down. At least we got a front row seat. At least we got a front row seat. At least we got a front row seat. One of the fun parts of uh, singing new songs is you learn a little bit about how it's working and what it all means when it's up next to each other. And one thing that I've learned tonight is I've written way too many songs in the same key. <laughs> <laughs> Almost every single one is an E major. So I'm going to get the cable out for some of these. This next one, I'm, uh, I'm hesitant to play it, but I'm just going to play it anyway. It's probably, I'm going for a record for worst song ever to sing on Father's Day, I think. <laughs> um, I started a long time ago, and I wasn't able to finish until today, actually. So um, I'm excited that it's brand new, but I also don't know if it's a good idea, but I'm going to roll the dice. It's called You Tell the Boys. Situation, 
I'll be very far But that's only once you've told them everything So I can just hold them for a while And closely and they're not making noise They should have never see their daddy crying Or hear that little crack in his voice You, you tell the boys Oh, you, you tell the boys Specifically, how fragile our social construct is. And that doesn't have to be in regards to COVID or the pandemic or the lockdown or whatever you call it. Um, and that's what this song's about. This song's called Joke of There Somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> Each morning, my beloved asked me to open up my eyes, see what kind of attention I could get. I see a corporate coffee house putting up their Christmas decorations, commuter cars all waiting at the lights, the line outside the rising full of hopeful conversations. Some local band is playing it at night. A couple walks their dog, discussing what to eat for dinner. A runaway is being read its rights. A hotel hosts a conference, called investment for beginners. Some high school coach is breaking up a fire. There's a job in the sun. Joke in there somewhere. A joke in there somewhere. One that I just don't know how to tell. Each afternoon, my doctor. As we sit down in a chair, and he asked him to walk him through my day. I hear radios ring ball games, 
to an ancient place of traffic, a star and dark that's whimpering in pain, a sound shape through the eye that sounds like something close to magic for a traveling that is by the Mrs. Blaine. A boomer on a cell phone talking through party provisions, but he had giant bullseye neon sign. Next to big of Dixie Cups, pizza crusts, and giant televisions. The allegory of the conga line. Cause there's a joke in this song. A joke in this song. In the way a stranger wishes us good night. And he says, Every time you sat here getting nervous for the future, we ended up some version of okay. These songs we are singing, they shouldn't give a little advice. This should give some kind of strength to meet the day. Cause it has a joke in the sun A joke in the sun Time in a while. But 
don't think I'm living any questions Just because they make me smile This world is bound to break your heart But I got you There's an awful lot of moving parts But I I'm looking for the bigger picture, but keep an eye on the little ones too. Keep an eye on the little ones too. Some ancient human chance encounter. Ten thousand years BC was just as vital to the drama as your mom's first day with me. The fates that weave your brain together. What makes you so obsessed with waterfalls? It's too far beyond our understanding. We can just marvel that we're even here at all. Because this world is bound to break your heart. There's an awful lot of moving parts, but I got you. So keep on looking for the little picture, but keep an eye on the little ones too. Thank you guys doing up on the sides. When I do my fake eye contact, Sam totally ignoring you guys, so. Yeah. I just can't see you. The lights are in my face. I can't see you. So don't take it personally. <laughs> We're connected. Song's called King That Never Wills. I watched you hold court with the graduate class of your fan club. The same tired stories at the end of your favorite part. And to give them a bit of suspense, you tell them in the present tense, as if you believe that's the person you somehow still are. The assumption was always that. Pay the same share of the dues that all of us 
motto You can instance the change of the plan And prepare the road for the man Instead of just simply preparing the man for the road
Between the chemical trails in the morning and the UFOs at night, the sky becomes a canvas for my worst conspiracies. And through the storm clouds that were forming, more black and blue than white, I saw two shooting stars as I gave While the traveled road lives up to its cliché Desperately just trying to hold on to something Cause I'm learning that the time flies either way I confuse a sense of purpose with grabbing the future by the throat. While the museum of my memories was just some blurry photographs. When I was younger, I was serious. Now everything's a joke, but my friends detect the sadness. At the end of every life Which has left me with a tricky sense of humor And I keep getting further and astray Every punchline takes on another dimension Once you realize that the time flies either way. And at the height of this confusion, it's when your eyes met mine. I caught a small chance at salvation. Staring back at me, I saw my boyhood reach conclusion. I saw a life spent at your side. I saw the permanent replacement of all the use and eyes for we. Would be spent trying to put a smile on your face. And I'm letting that back answer all of my questions. Cause I know now that the time flies either way. I know now. That the time flies either way. Do one more for you guys, and I'm letting you go. This all night, this is a dream for me, truly. <laughs> this is how I write the songs and you know, playing them at big shows sometimes, you know, or yeah, like you don't you don't know. Um, I don't know, when I go to shows, sometimes I'm not paying attention to a third verse necessarily. <laughs> so for you guys to be in this with me the whole night and just um, uh, yeah, I just feel really connected. I feel really lucky. I feel really grateful. I feel really, yeah, I feel a lot of things right now. So thank you so much for coming.
With his back against the San Francisco traffic On the bridge's side the faces towards the jail Setting out to join the demographic He hoists his first leg up over the rail Little phone calls made and police cars show up quickly And the sergeant slammed his passenger door He says, hey kid, why don't you talk through this with me? Just tell me what you're doing it for. Oh, it's a little bit of everything. It's the mountains, it's the fog. It's the news at six o'clock. It's the death of my first dog. It's the angels up above me. It's a song that they don't sing. It's a little bit of everything. There's an older man who stands in a buffet line. He's smiling and he's holding out his plate. And the further that he looks back into his timeline, that hard road always led him to the day. He's making up for when his bright future just left him. He's making up for the fact that his only son is gone And letting everything out once his server asked him Have you figured out yet what it is you want? I'll have a little bit of everything The biscuits and the beans Whatever helps me to forget about these things that brought me to my knees so pile on those mashed potatoes How about an extra chicken wing Cause I'll be having a little bit of everything Somewhere a pretty girl is writing invitations For the wedding that she has scheduled in the fall Her man says, baby can I make an observation? You don't seem to be having any fun at all. She says you can just worry about your groomsmen and your shirt size. And rest assured that this is making me feel good. I think that love is so much easier than we realize. If you can give yourself to someone, then you should. Cause it's a little bit of everything. The way you laugh, the way you wait. It's getting up before you, so I can watch you as you wait. So on that day in late September, it's not just some stupid fucking thing. I'll be getting a little bit of everything. It's a little bit of everything. It's the matador and the whole. It's the suggested daily dosing. It's the rhythm and its hold. All these psychics and these doctors, they're all right and they're all wrong. It's like trying to make out every word when they should simply move along. It's not some message written in the dark or some truth that no one sees. It's just a little bit of everything.
Hope you're ready. 